Ukraine, how will we know if war has started? Everyone is trying to second-guess President Vladimir Putin's intentions in Ukraine. The U.S. is pulling embassy staff out as fears rise of looming conflict. But maybe it's already started, writes security and defense expert Jonathan Marcus. The risk of an all-out war between Russia and Ukraine dominates the headlines. All the obvious questions are being asked. Will Russia attack? Is President Vladimir Putin determined upon war come what may? Or can diplomacy secure peace? But we cannot see inside President Putin's mind. So here's another question, how will we know when hostilities commence? Tanks rolling, rockets firing the answer seems obvious. Clearly massed Russian tank formations crossing Ukraine's frontiers, or a massive rocket barrage or airstrikes against Ukrainian positions, would mark a dramatic escalation in the crisis and a shift to a new phase of the conflict. The first alarms will come from the Ukrainian military itself, but Western military satellites and intelligence-gathering aircraft may well spot the preparations for an imminent offensive. There will probably be clear signs of an impending onslaught, says Michael Kaufman, an expert on the Russian military at the US-based Center for Naval Analyses. Among them are the manning of formations, he says, since a lot of what has been deployed is heavy equipment rather than the troops themselves. Other signs could be the dispersal of forces, an influx of logistical and support elements, and a shift in fixed wing and rotary aviation. But the question can also be answered in another way, and for this, we need to stand back and view the Russian campaign against Ukraine in its entirety. We need to look at the full toolkit available to Moscow and assess how it is being used. And in this light, when you ask, how will we know if the conflict has started, then the answer may be that it already has. Hostilities have actually been underway for some years.